Okay, check this out. I can now upgrade my weapon for the second time. I upgraded the sham shirt once and I got this thing called a Dusik, I guess? It looks like we can get one called Seven Branch Sword, so let's do that. The easier of the two options, but I don't care. I just want to get some higher stats. Whoa! That is very weird. Alright. <laughs> what have we got in here? I think that's good, actually. Why don't we... Your thunder. Okay, I think it's time that we pay a certain flying doggo a visit. This amount of damage. I haven't trained the, the cat at all, so I can't really remember exactly how this fight goes. So this, this will be interesting. That's the that's that's the dog. That's the dog, all right. Okay, so we give him this key here, and let's go. Hi, Popper Schnupper. What a cute little guy. Uh oh, he's not friendly. Be careful, Inky. Seems that Duran is being manipulated, but then there's no choice but to fight him. Use your power to break the spell. You mean my power of hitting things? My favorite power. Okay, let's go. First fight. Duran. What a cute character. No. Okay, so I think I have to shoot him a couple times with the cat. Come here. Come here, meow. Hit him once. Here, I'm gonna hit. Oh, dear. Come on, dude. No. Okay, so that's the trick. Is to stay on top of him and then hit him with the cat once. He should come down. I don't. Even, I don't think I even have like a real weapon equipped. Sure, he's dead. Here. <gasps> it's a big area, but for some reason. Get a lot of room to uh, do much. 115 damage, you see that? <laughs> this is gonna be easy. He's back up in the air. Switch over to her. Pop into my menu here and heal before I kill myself on accident. I'm not paying attention. I might as well heal my weapon too. I'll bet you. What do you What do you think? One more hit and he's dead. I'm doing over 100 damage every time. Hey! 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 Take damage! Hey! Hit him with a stick! There we go! Three shots and he's down! <laughs> no problem. I was training that weapon forever. Alright, voice. Mmm, what has happened to me and who are you? What? You say I was being manipulated? Not sure why he turned into Grover, but okay. I, Duran, god of the beast, what an embarrassment! Hey kid, sorry about that. Hmm, I see. So what has been happening on Earth? The Dark Genie, that's what the Ozman the Fairy King called it. If that's the case, we might be in trouble. I've heard that name before. Okay, I'm sick of this place. Long ago, a monster called Black Demon appeared in East Terra. The creature caused massacre after massacre and almost brought the world to an end. Neither the most gallant knights nor the most powerful of sorcerers could stand before the horror of the creature, much less harm it. Its power seemed as vast as the limitless power of the genies, thus people started to call it the Dark Genie. It wiped out nearly all of the known kingdoms of the world. Ultimately, only a few people survived on Earth. 
Then, when all seemed lost, a tribe called the Moon People created an enormous urn that could seal tremendous magic power and chart around the dark genie inside. The world recovered and peace was restored. The world was saved by the Moon People and their mastery of the magical arts. That's about all I know. If you want to go after the dark genie, you'd better have the Moon People on your side. I hear that the Moon People live quietly deep in the woods in a place located beyond the Matataki village. The Matataki village is the south of Naroon. Why not go there first? Okay. How uh, did the fairy king, who never liked humans, have gave a kid a, like you the power of the stone? He's up to something. He's got something. <laughs> oh well, I can use some fresh air for a change. Hop on my back and I'll give you a lift outside. Yay, pupper friend. <laughs> How do we get out, by the way? It's like... No doors. Arise. Arise from the hill. This, this strange ledge-like hill. Wall-like hill. Ugh, what a cute character. Gosh. He's like a big giant gizmo dog. Oh, I love Dran so much. I appreciate your work, kid. I don't have a clue just how powerful the genie is, but it was powerful enough to control me. Be prepared and take this along with you. Thanks, map. This is no plain world map, kid. It's a magical map that takes you to the place you point to instantly. First, use the map to go to the land of Matataki Village. I hear that the moon people live deep inside the wise owl forest. Oh my god, so much for glowing stuff. Visit the tree and follow the river. He might look a bit weird, but he takes good care of people. He sure is good to give you a he is sure to give you a hand. So long Bye dog It's not really ever explained how he's a god or what a god means in the context of this universe but there we go okay so <laughs> that's it we annihilated the first boss next episode we'll be starting Matataki village and yeah starting going through some lever we're covering more atla and yeah we're gonna keep playing dark cloud i freaking love this game it's so relaxing and i just find it hilarious to overtrain in RPGs like this and then just destroy the bosses. So yeah, we're gonna keep doing that. Anyway, have a great rest of the week and bye!